you, mate. Daryl, over the yeah. line, a, a second win in a row, and uh, you must be feeling good about yourself. Yeah, no, uh, really positive after that game. I mean, Nathan, for me, has been one of the most improved players, one of the best players in the world in the last uh, few years. And uh, he's one of my best friends. And uh, I had to get the ruthless um, Daryl Garnier tonight. And uh, a couple of last third finishes uh, kept me in there, kept me in the game. And uh, got the adrenaline pump whenever I was giving it a wee bit. Didn't start so well, but that one four four checkout that really seemed to turn the tide, and, and that really got you going, didn't it? Uh, yeah, so I'm told because um, I thought somebody says to me I was I was averaging really really poor in the first three legs, um, but uh, yeah, I turned it around then. But the thing was, I was so focused that it didn't matter what came before. I just thought, uh, just throw as best you can on your throw, pull throw, and uh, give yourself a chance to break him. Uh, I was very lucky in the league. I actually did break him because I think he did have three darts at a double day hold. He missed it and I left myself 16 and took it out. And uh, at the end of the day, I was a game changer. Obviously, Gerwin was one of the names that was down there and he had a, a convincing victory before you. Was that something you were aware of? Did you know that you needed to win to stay in touch with him? Yeah, I was aware of. But um, before I came here this week, I thought to myself, if I don't get uh, six points... Um, if not five points, um, I'm guaranteed uh, to be uh, eliminated. So uh, for me, it was one last night, give myself the opportunity to keep it going, put the pressure on the other two players, and then obviously Gizzy played before me. I won, so uh, the, the pressure's kind of switched to Rob. I've no idea how Rob's getting on now, but um, yeah, ho hopefully after tonight, or tomorrow night, I'm more, uh, I'm more in a positive uh, position. I mean, your mental game must be, at the moment, after these last two games, it must have gone from not in a brilliant position, you must be mentally in a good position now, going into that judgment night. Um, yeah, I mean, the way I played tonight, I know I played a lot better than I did tonight than previous, but um, I felt the exact same way. I felt like I had a lot more to give, even that game. Against Nathan, I had a lot more to give. I've been practicing so much, so so much better, and uh, it was just one of the things that last night, uh, whenever whenever I played um, Chris, he, he wasn't coming. There was nothing really coming back. It was kind of both of us were struggling, but uh, he fell over the finish line last uh, last night and then tonight. Then I played a lot better and uh, got another win. So uh, hopefully, continue it on tomorrow night. And uh, you just never know what's going to happen. And just finally, what were the nerves like in that final leg? Because it was obviously a, a very big moment in your Premier League career. Yeah, no, I mean, I thought to myself, just, just if you're going to play, just try your damnedest. They had a, a treble every throw and uh, try and do a 15 dirter. Uh, <laughs> Uh, just a couple of four tons and then try and have a go at the 101 or something along these lines. But um, yeah, I think uh, I think I put Nathan under pressure whenever I started off well in the first uh, six darts, nine darts. Uh, and then he was always chasing, obviously, after that because he's pushing for the point. But uh, yeah, thankfully, came through at the end and got the two points that I needed. That's it, Daryl. Thank you very much and uh, congratulations. Cheers, Josh. Thank you very much.